everyone, I'm Shishi here, chilling with the ladies from MTV's new hit show, Faking It. How are you girls doing tonight? Oh, good. Okay. Very good. Okay. Yeah. Now, Katie, Amazing. being back at American Idol, does it bring back a lot of memories? It brings back a lot of memories. Uh, Rita was making fun of me because oh. everywhere we walked, I saw someone that I knew, like, from the show. I'm like, I'm like, hey, Patrick, hey, this, and she's, she knows no one, so she's like, hey, parking lot. <laughs> excited because this was where everything started for me and I feel like you know it was like my preschool into you know Hollywood okay it was you know I came out here at 17 I was still a high school student and uh -huh. got thrown into the big idol bubble and then <laughs> here I am now in the MTV bubble <laughs> I know and the MTV bubble seems like so much fun how much fun are you ladies having on the show a uh, blast. 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 There's so many things that we wouldn't have been able to do if we hadn't been, you know, a part of the MTV family. Uh -huh. So, um, like having a billboard yes. in, Times in Times Square. Square. Hashtag no big deal. Yeah. <laughs> Just another and day. Also getting to go to the MTV Movie Awards and then we're going to get to go to the VMAs. And one of the highlights wow. of MTV Movie Awards was Eminem performed. And I turned to Rita and she was crying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Eminem was a little bit of your man crush, huh? Uh, just, uh, you can say that. Uh, yeah, 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 just, just a little bit. Well, we Man won't Crush talk, Monday. We'll talk about it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. She's still yeah. blushing. I'm still blushing. I love it. I love it. And I want to know from you, ladies, what is the most outrageous thing you have ever faked? Keep it real. You can keep it real with us. Okay. One, two, three. Orgasm. <laughs> ah, they are human, and they've done it. I love it. Everyone fakes Wait, it. Wait, no. Yes. Wait, my parents might see this. No. Yeah, we're, we're just kidding. Or, I know, I've done or that so I many also times. had, I could say this because my oh. mom supported it, but I uh, had a fake ID. Oh, your mom supported it? Okay, I can't say I supported it, but like okay. she knew I had one. Like she, she didn't throw it care. away, yeah. but she didn't like take you to get it. She didn't take me. To, oh, I got it all <laughs> on my own. Trip out of it. Actually, they had lunch. Wow. They got the fake ID and then they got their nails done. It was, no, I yeah. I got the fake ID, uh -huh. but like, you know, my parents would let me use it when I was with them. Yeah. And it worked. It was great. Oh wow. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> good job, parents. Your mom is like, oh, she's 21. She's good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. They they helped me out. Good, good, good. And you know, it always gets worse because when you're older, you can't remember whether you're pulling out the real one or the fake one. Well, I got rid so, of the fake yeah. one. Oh, you did? Okay. I'm legal now. Oh, really? She had one from each state, huh? She did. What? I and see countries. her. And, wow. International over here. I like you, Miss Katie like Stevens. Yeah. She's saying, so I feel like karma right now. We're like a rumor <laughs> starting, but people like me for it. So I'm like, yeah. I love it. And how much has your life changed since the show aired on MTV? Because I know you ladies are receiving so many social media feedback from fans. Um, I, I mean, I had like loyal fans that had followed me from Idol oh. follow me back to faking it. Um, but like within days just gained like 15,000 followers wow. and like they're all people that want Rita and I to be dating in real life and like there's like shipping whatever that means and like oh, and OTP oh, one yes. two pairing what, is what? That? oh is that what that means yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they love, they want you guys to be together for real. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Um, my, my moment came when someone, I don't know who did this, but you are incredible. They made a speed painting video on YouTube of of my face of this picture that I took wow. with my co-star in a trailer, and they and they took my expression and they painted it, and that's uh -huh. when I was like, oh man. There's a tutorial on stuff. It. If you ever want to learn how to paint Rita's <laughs> face? <laughs> yeah. Look it up. For those I who want to do oh that. Oh my god, okay, okay. If, yeah, if all you have right. nothing else to do, you know. I don't. You are like kind of like a testament to all the idol contestants who didn't win the show. Like, you're making it here in Hollywood. This I... is huge. I would like to think so yeah. um, because I, I just remember and it's hard when you get off idol to kind of like try and find yourself and oh. figure out what to do next mm -hmm. um, and it takes a long time and mm -hmm. you need to like establish yourself outside of the show and the show is an amazing place to start a platform oh. so I'm very fortunate and thankful to have had that mm -hmm. um, but yeah I want to like talk to the contestants and stuff because I know that when you get eliminated it can be discouraging yeah but there is life after Idol, and you can be successful having that platform and proceeding on. Hi, Pop Stop TV. Watch us on Faking It on MTV, Tuesdays at 10.30. Yes.